thank you for tuning back into my channel so today is going to be kind of a show and tell of these locks that i have in this video is sponsored by cosmo biz i am a beauty examiner for them now and this hair is from jenna collection it is the two-time mambo rock and locks the links that i got were 20 i think i got seven packs i used six packs but of course you can see i did cut them in half because i'm trying to stick with more of the shorter styles for a little minute but overall i'm glad i cut it because it's nice and it's full now these locks are a little bit different um the texture is very very um similar to real locks they tried to make sure that the texture was i don't know if i can even describe it they a very coarse looking so that it can mimic real locks in a pack you get let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so you get 10 locks in a pack i got seven packs so that's about 70 locks the main reason why i cut them is because usually when i get seven packs it's not enough so i know if i cut them in half it will be enough now the thing about these locks is it doesn't have a little ring at the top so for instance let me slide one out it's just a whole piece of lock so when you crochet this in you have to pull it so it's like a shoestring on the side of your braid. So it'll be one here and one here and then you make the knot. If that makes any sense at all. So you will have to manipulate it just a little bit more since there is not a knot. But this also makes it full because it'll be a double lock instead of just one lock. If that makes any sense at all. So... Clearly, this is super, super thick. This is a 1 and a 30. And I did go ahead and decorate them some, as you can see. I didn't actually show myself crocheting it in because um, because it's, there's hundreds and thousands of videos of crochet braids. And they're really all the same. But I will have a video of me playing with my hair while I was in the middle of doing it because I kept stopping and recording but yeah so far I do like this hair a lot I especially appreciate the texture and how coarse it is my only concern with this hair is it does like I can pull out little hairs I feel like that's because I did cut it and let me show you the technique what happens when you cut it Okay, I feel like that happened because I did cut it. So if you cut it, you are going to get little pieces of hair that come out. You can also dip this in water just to put it together a little bit more. I also feel like over time it's going to start clumping together, kind of like how it is now. But that's because it's synthetic hair. That's what you should expect with synthetic hair. But there is one technique you must know if you're going to cut it. So like I just literally cut it in half like so and now you see one side is blunt one side is how a lock would look so after i cut it i have to palm roll it so i sat here and i palm rolled it to get it to match the size then i went ahead and i crocheted them all in just as you normally would Except you have to literally pull one side through like this, then make your knot. So overall, so far I do like this hair. I'm going to try to keep it in for a couple days, but I do have other reviews that I need to do. But this is six packs split in half of the two-time Mambo Rockin' Locks from Janet Collection. that I did cut in half I originally got 20 inches I think I got two packs of 30 um maybe three packs of 30 I think it was five packs of one and two packs of 30 
So if you're interested in this hair, definitely check out the links below so you can purchase it. It is affordable. It mimics real locks. And so far, I absolutely love it. So thank you guys for watching. If you're interested in this hair, be sure to check out the links below. And until next time, I will see you guys later. Love me.